What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel today guys. We're going to be taking a look at my WWE trading card collection. Uh, as you can see uh, over here I got a slab and the auto uh, and all of these are the old WCW uh, trading cards like 1990, 1991. Uh, so today guys we're going to be taking a look at these trading cards. Uh, so without further ado I'll push these to the back and First two, I'll go ahead and uh, let you guys take a look at. First one is 20, I think it's 2022. 2022 Panini Impeccable WWE. And it's the Showstopper. I think that's his nickname. Dolph Ziggler. Uh, Elegance from Impeccable. 23 out of 99 auto with a star. Uh, so I thought that was pretty cool. I picked that one up. And uh, the next one is a slab that I got in a lot that I did. Uh, not the best grade, but it's a CSG uh, Certified Sports Guarantee. Uh, 2010 Tops WWE Platinum, Bobby the Brain Heenan. And it's not even really a good card to grade, so not really for sure um, as to why uh, someone sent that off to grading. But... Picked that up in a lot, so thought I'd keep it since I do PC WWE cards as well. Um, and these cards, they are going to be double-sided uh, due to the fact that when I purchased these, I recently bought these at a yard sale, and uh, they put two cards in one top loader. So uh, some of them are going to have double cards uh, in the double-sided, so I'll show you the, uh, the cards on the double sides. So let's get right into it. The first one, as you guys seen, was WCW Sting with the yellow border, the red, yellow with the red border, blue w, uh, WCW logo, and that is Surfer Sting on the first one. Mr. Wall Street, Mr. Wall Street on the back of that one as well. Next up, how about a Lex Luger? Lex Luger, Lex Luger, my bad, and Arn Anderson. How about a Lex Luger on this one? And him and Ric Flair on that one. Next up, we do have Ricky Morton. And as you can see, 1991 WCW, uh, 205 pounds, Nashville, Tennessee, Ricky Morton. Next up, we do have another Ricky Morton. Uh, two more. Uh, next up, how about a Flying Brian? Uh, the double sided there. Move over to Doom. I think this is Farouk. Ron, uh, Ron Simmons, if I'm not mistaken. A couple of Doom cards there. St Ron Simmons and Sting. Terry Taylor, 1991. Some of these might be duplicates. I uh, haven't really uh, looked through a bunch of these, but Steiner Brothers. I think this is Rick. Rick I think that's Rick Steiner, if I'm not mistaken. Steiner Brothers in the college uniforms or the college jersey or Letterman jersey or Letterman, Letterman jacket, rather. Uh, some more Steiner Brothers, Rick Steiner, Scott Steiner, S Surfer Sting, in the green and peach ring gear, there's Sting on the top rope, and Surfer Sting again, next up is Doom, with Ric Flair, Ron Simmons, We've got Doom as the WCW Tag Team Champions of the World. Next up, we have another Sting. 1991 WCW. This was back in the glory days of uh, wrestling. There's another Sting. Ric Flair, I think it is. Next up, we have a Ric Flair. Looks like he's doing a suplex. Or, I think that's, is, no, it's not, you guys let me know what that move is. Is that a, that's not a suplex. That's a, 
I'm not really for sure. I can't remember what kind of move that is. But Ric Flair doing the knee. Nature Boy. Kind of set those out of the way. Ric Flair and Surfer Sting. I really like that gear. The red, white, and the blue on that gear. Ric Flair in the robe, the butterfly robe. There's Ric Flair again. Ric Flair in the butter, butterfly robe. There's Ric Flair in the suit. Fabulous Freebirds and Ricky Morton. And there they are on the back side of the cards. One of the four horsemen, Arn Anderson, Sting, and Sting on the back. Arn Anderson and Fabulous Freebirds on those two. Next up, we have uh, Sid Vicious and the Freebirds. Um, you guys let me know down in the comments. I guess you really can't let me know. Is it uh, Gigante? I'm not really for sure how to pronounce his name. Um, so. It's him, Sid Vicious, and Lex Luger. There's another one of him. Z-Man. Some of these I've never heard before, like Z-Man. I've never, never did hear of this guy in, uh, in professional wrestling, so... Arn Anderson, Sid Vicious. So, Arn Anderson, Sid Vicious on this one and on the back as well. <coughs> Dutch Mantle. Dutch Mantle. So, I think these are really cool. I think I paid like 10 bucks for these. So, not bad at all. Mr. Wall Street. They're not the most expensive things, but um, I do PC WWE as well. So, Z-Man Flying Brian. I really like some of the newer cards. Uh, like Prism. And... Got one stack left to go through. Tommy Rich. You guys let me know down in the comments, like, names like this, like, like, who are these guys? Tommy Rich. Terry Taylor. Terry Taylor on these two as well. And the butterfly robe, just like um, uh, Ric Flair. Terry Taylor, fabulous free birds on those. A couple more of the fabulous free birds. All of these need to be taken out and uh, put in singular top loaders uh, and penny sleeves, which I will get to uh, eventually. Flying Brian and Dutch Mantle. Flying Brian on those two as well. Lex Luger. Lex Luger. Sid Vicious. And Ric Flair. Sid Vicious on the last two. Oh, look at that one. And that one to end it is Ric Flair as the WCW Heavyweight Champion of the World. And look at that smile on the champion's face. Ric Flair. This concludes my WWE trading card collection. You guys, let me know down in the comments below what was your favorite uh, card in my WWE collection, WCW 
trading card collection. As always, don't forget to hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, and we'll see you guys on the next one.